going, everyone? Mega Mashers here, and I gotta give a big shout out to one of my subscribers, Scott Rosenfeld, for sending me this article on the Smogon Forums page. And wow. Wow, 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 wow. If this is legit, then this could shift the OU tier quite majorly. This right here, a potential suspect test. Uh, I have uh, someone who actually created this thread, and he asked the question, what do you think about the idea of suspecting Arceus Bug for OU? Just think about that for a second. Arceus. Arceus Bug. You know, the god of Pokemon. Holy shit. Oh my god. Like, that That would be, that would be just, wow. <laughs> I, I don't even know what to say about this. I mean, I think that it would be... It would be very, very uh, over-centralizing, in my opinion, because everybody would want to use Arceus, because Arceus is essentially, you know, like a free mega-slash-uber. I mean, it's based at total of 720, um, and there are very powerful megas whose base stat total exceeds 600, and even uh, 700 if you uh, count Pokemon like Mega Tyranitar, uh, Mega Metagross, all those things. Like, this, along with uh, Hoopa Unbound, Kieran Black, holy shit. <laughs> Based at total overwhelming! Holy shit. So, what do I think about this whole thing? Well, let's just, let's just, uh, let's just go ahead and actually take a look at Arceus Bug real quick. So, it's Bug, obviously, and let's just take a look at its resists and weaknesses. So, it resists fighting, grass, and ground which is a pretty solid uh, amount of resistances. However, it's weak to flying, fire, and rock. And by rock, you also got to factor in the fact that it's weak to stealth rocks. But take a look at its stats. 120 is all across the board. That means that this thing is powerful, this thing is fast, and the thing's bulky as hell. The thing has access to defog, which means that it's going to knock Mew right out of the park as being the bulkiest defogger if this thing was to ever land in the OU. Holy shit. Now let's just go ahead and take a look at a set that this thing could easily run and murder entire teams in the OU tier. So we got Swords Dance. Swords Dance boosts your attack by two stages. And considering that when you max base 120 attack with the Jolly Nature... That's 339 points in your attack. Factor in a Swords Dance, you have 678. And also factor in the fact that with Insect Plate, boost your bug type moves by 20%. And because of the thing getting X Scissor, it's going to get boosted from the Insect Plate and with Stab. And if that's not enough, this thing also has access to the Edge Quake combo, being Earthquake and Stone Edge. Which means that... Any switch-ins, like to uh, Talonflame, thinking that, oh, Gale Wings, you know, I can just Gale Wings Brave Bird you. Uh, if Arceus Bug telegraphs that, it stone edges you and clips your damn wings. Same with Mega Pinsir, same with Dragonite. Like, what the fuck, man? Holy shit. Oh my god. And yeah, here you go again. Anyways, like, I'm just, I'm just dumbfounded right now. But, like, reading through this whole article... It seems like that the majority of the people that have replied to this article are sh so strongly against uh, even suspecting this thing for OU. Can you say you blame them? I mean, this thing, like I said, base 120s all across the board. That is busted as fuck. And bug being a single typing is not even that bad of a typing. Now, I can understand, you know, like, if them suspect testing, like, Arceus Ice or something, because... I actually have our CS Ice up here. Let's just take a look at this real quick. Its only resist is to ice. It's weak to biting, fire, rock, and steel. Including stealth rocks. Not to mention this thing is weak to common priority moves such as mock punch and bullet punch. Technician bullet punch would destroy this thing with rocks on the field. No questions. So, I mean, if they're, if they're going to suspect any Uber's Pokemon for OU, I think maybe... Arceus Ice? Like, if they're going to suspect test Arceus at all, uh, it should be Arceus Ice form. Um, but, 
you know, that's just that's just me. That's neither here nor there. Um, one of the uh, one of the reasonings behind the uh, possibility of a suspect test for Arceus Bug is because it's forced to uh, hold the insect plate, which means that it essentially has no item to use in battle. But holding a plate is not even that bad. You get a free 20% boost to your bug type stab. That means that X scissor is going to hurt like a bitch. It's going to fucking hurt. And it's just, oh my god. Like, holy shit. You know, this kind of brings me back to the whole um, suspect test of Giratina Origin, where I actually, uh, I actually was actually on board with it, but turns out it is an April Fool's joke. And I will say that from a neutral standpoint and me representing Smogon, I gotta say that that was actually a pretty bad joke. I mean, it was at the expense of hundreds of and thousands of people who legitimately thought that this was not a joke. I mean, think about it. Giratina Origin. I mean, yeah, sure, it has to hold the Grissius Orb, which gives a 20% boost to its uh, ghost and dragon type moves, but it's it has to hold its orb and therefore, it has no free item slot, unlike Giratina uh, Altered Form, whatever, which can use leftovers or whatever. But Giratina Origin is forced to use its orb in order for it to be Giratina Origin, or for it to be used legally. But this isn't about Giratina Origin. Um, wow. I just, I think that, uh, th like, this this right here is a very interesting lead. I, uh, read. I will leave a link in the description box down below. For anybody that wants to read this, I'm just going to read this a, a little bit about what this uh, gentleman here says. So, um, let's see. The Giratina... I'm not even going to read that part here. I began to ponder if this clause could be uh, implemented to other Pokemon, the most obvious candidates being the Arceus form since they follow a similar concept. Then I turned my attention to Arceus Bug. The more I look at the more I believe that Arceus Bug really might be too strong for OU. That's true. Uh, pure bug typing is not stellar offensively um, or defensively, but, you know, it's not the worst uh, single typing there is. Um, so I thought I could it could have a legitimate th shot at remaining an OU. I admit that this is more so a selfish experiment on my part to see if our bug typing is truly enough of a nerf uh, to Arceus rather than an attempt to balance the meta. I think, in my opinion, this is going to throw the meta way off balance. Like, if Arceus Bug comes down from Ubers, Hoopa Unbound's going to be in trouble. Any good Psychic-type Pokemon like Mew is going to be in trouble. We could be seeing some significant drops in the likes of the usage of Starmie, Hoopa Unbound, Mew. If Arceus Bug is found on every single team, I mean, shit. Holy fuck. <laughs> um, yeah, so I want your guys' opinion on this. Um, although that this is just like, it's it's not even a, a close to it being an official thing, uh, especially based on the amount of comments against it, you know, like, uh, like we got, we got so many people that are against it, but I might actually do a discussion video on whether or not Arceus Bug could, in fact, uh, bounce out or overthrow the entire OU metagame. So leave me your thoughts in the comments section down below as to what you guys think about all this. Uh, I'm I'm still very stunned about this. What the fuck? So anyways, I hope you guys have yourselves a good one, and be sure to read up on this article, because man, oh man, I know I'm going to right after this. So... Subscribe for more content, and I shall see you guys next upload.